He's been your servicing dealer since 1956. That is the tagline that Elmer Carl says in every one of his TV commercials. In tonight's Eye on Kelloland, we take a look back at Elmer Carl's humble beginnings and see how Elmer turned electronics into an empire. Oh, Mr. Um, Carl. Yeah. How are you? After a brief stint in the military, serving in the Korean War, a very young Elmer Carl decided it was time for another type of service, fixing TVs. After attending school in Chicago, he returned to his hometown of Gregory, South Dakota and opened his very first store. I rented a building for, uh, as I recall, $30 a month. A year later, after careful consideration, he bought the building and decided he probably should start selling appliances too. After all, not many families owned TVs back in the 1950s. So I said, well, we'll try it. And that worked pretty good. Then he opened another store in winter. It wasn't long after that that the business began to grow. He expanded to several other cities one by one. Well, I'll tell you the truth, uh, it was not my intention to ever grow the company. My intention was to be a uh, TV repairman in Gregory. Today, you'll still find Elmer making the rounds at his stores, visiting with staff and customers. His success, he says, is easy to define. Uh, I had foresight to uh, hire good people, and uh, they became part of the company. And That's right. Those employees now own almost 50% of the company. Tom Johnson is one of them. He's the general manager of the store in Sioux Falls. I've learned so much from him, um, not just in the business world, but uh, about being involved in the community. Johnson has worked for Elmer for 20 years, and in that time, he says Elmer taught him one of the most important lessons in business, treat customers like family. I call it the e-culture, and it's the culture of Elmer, and it's Main Street. Um, it's Main Street Winter, it's Main Street Gregory. It's Main Street, Sioux Falls, La Crosse, St. Cloud. You know, we live in a rural community. We're not a big city. We still have our farmers uh, are the backbone of who we are. And it's that, that sense of community is who brings us the door swings every day. And they're our friends and they're our family. And that's the one lasting legacy I'll never forget about Elmer Carl. Hello. And that's the culture of E. Take care of you, okay? While many big box stores have closed across the country, they say the culture of E is what's kept this once small business competitive and relevant. And you know what, Don? Uh, over 20 years, it's been the most important piece of uh, our business is taking care of our customers. You can buy this stuff anywhere but it's who's going to take care of you. The Slam Dunk Savings event continues here at Carl's. Elmer's commercials have made him a household name, not only in South Dakota, but in all seven states where he now has close to 30 stores. But what you can do for your kitchen. At 87, Elmer still enjoys what he does, including shooting the commercials. Anytime anyone asks him when he's going to call it quits, he sort of avoids the question and jokes. There will probably be a notice in the paper and lunch at the church. <laughs> we get it. Elmer has no plans of retiring because he loves what he does and Hello. serving his customers. I'm Elmer. And that's really been our, you know, strong point. We're, we're the servicing dealer since 1956, just in case you missed that. <laughs> Carl Stevie and Appliance also has a blog that talks about everything from how to get a better night's sleep to grilling ideas for summer. We have posted a link to his blog under this story at kelloland.com. Such a fun guy. Yeah, very nice.